what's up YouTube? Um, Two Wheel Gardener here. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Um, today video, I'm gonna talk about owning chickens for a year, one year of having uh, the chickens that we have here. They're all inside the coop right now because I guess the chair freaked them out and everything like that, so they all ran in. Um, one year review of owning chickens. We have six hens, four golden comets, and two Plymouths. Uh, I mean, two barred rocks. They're black. The barred rocks are black and white. The golden comets are golden in color. They're all good uh, producer of eggs, and they're all laying brown, brownish color eggs. When I first got these chickens, I got them from Tractor Supply when they were, you know, yay big couple weeks old I throw up some pictures of progress through um, starting with chicks and going up from there all I know is when you first get them you have about maybe a month or so before you have to get them out of you know if you have them in your garage or if you if it's like your first time, if you have them in the house, I had mine in a spare bedroom in a big, um, like 50 gallon Tupperware container. And that's where we kept them at. You're gonna need, you know, um, your heat lamp and stuff like that. But if they're in the house, you probably won't need a heat lamp because, hey, your house is probably warm or cooler or whatever. But to start off, you know, they're kind of talkative right now because they're kind of freaked out, like I said, by the chair. Um, the first thing first is we have I have a family not a big family it's me my wife and two kids I ended up getting six chickens didn't really want six but tractor supply only lets you get four and then I wanted the um, bar rocks the plant bar rocks because I like the way they look so I ended up with six if you don't have a big family or have no way to get rid of like a lot of eggs six might be a lot because I was gonna I'm thinking if you, if it's just for you and your family, two chickens will probably do. I get approximately six eggs a day. So that's half a dozen of eggs a day. And I give them to my family and stuff like that, but I still have so many eggs that I cannot go through. So um, I give a lot of them away. What I've learned since having the chickens, if you don't know nothing, this whole thing right here was with grass, but obviously they scratched and dug holes and everything like that so there's no grass here and that's another thing I didn't know they were gonna dig holes per se so um, make sure you put like some kind of like hog wire or some kind of mesh down when your chickens start digging if you have like predators in my I don't really have predators per se I haven't seen I'm seen a possum out in the front but nothing else more than that um, the whole upkeep of them is pretty simple like you know you just give them their food water make sure like I put a cover on top to make sure hawks and everything like that don't aren't able to get them I haven't had any problems with um, impacted crops or anything like that I try to make sure I keep um, grit you get that from your uh, feed stores or whatever it's literally like little ground pebbles that they keep in their uh, gizzards to help digest food also when feeding kind of like you want to do with yourself or like your kids you want to try to make sure they have a diverse something different to eat I mean I don't think chickens really care but different foods give benefits different benefits to your chicken just like with you when you're eating so a lot of time I give them the regular feed that's you know your regular feed is crumbles I don't use pellets some people like pellets whatever you like but I also get some kind of mixed bird seed with sunflower and stuff like that they have a lot of oils and everything like that to try to keep your chickens healthy if you know in the house I have apples or something like that that aren't that we're not gonna get to and finish eating. I give them apples out of the garden. I also give them collard green leaves a lot and they seem to like it a lot. So when springtime and you know summer was around, I gave them peppers, they ate all that stuff. And it's not, I know a lot of people back in the day say chickens are the 
garbage can in the backyard or like you know a garbage can for a bird or whatever but don't give them like meat and all kind of stuff like that just try to give them vegetables and fruits and stuff i've realized my chickens don't really like um grapes grapes and stuff like that blueberries and eh. so i try to just give them like uh leafy greens and stuff like that and they seem to like it they're but the other thing um with the chickens they're pretty self-sustainable you know there's not nothing really hard to deal with chickens the only thing you got to look out for is the predators depending on where you stay if you stay in the city you probably don't have to worry about that too much and the only problem i've had so far is one of my chickens pecks the eggs and then once they peck the eggs they eat the yolk which i don't want them to start doing and i can't figure out which one it is so that's the only problem i've had so far dealing with my chickens um i let them out to roam the yard do their thing and like i said chickens are fairly it's simple to take care of make sure they got their food and their water make sure nothing can get to them try to eat them make sure your dogs actually my dogs haven't had any um interaction with them besides through the fence but my chickens don't seem to care except for when maybe they're playing and they come flying past the uh, pen over here they freak out a little bit but yeah make sure your dogs can't get to them or anything can't get to them and they're pretty much self-sustainable you ain't got to worry about them forcing them back in the coop come nightfall when the sun goes down they automatically walk back in the coop for you i just come out here every night close the coop door and that's it i keep um and one thing I also did learn with my when I built my coop, if you haven't looked at uh, my coop video, go watch my, I'll drop a link in the uh, description. I built the coop out of pallets, and it seemed to be working fairly decent for me. The chickens are working, uh, liking it. When it's windy outside, they go in there, and they sit in the coop, and I haven't had any problems with it. I never got around to painting it, but it is what it is. Um... When I built my nesting box, I didn't build my nesting box big enough. So they don't really use my nesting box, unfortunately. But they lay the eggs right there in the corner, so I could just open the nesting box um, lid and still just reach in and grab the eggs. So it works out anyway. But for the most part, I learned that chickens are pretty easy to take care of. They're not, you know, it's nothing really major to just make sure. They have their clean water food. Make sure you have some kind of, like I said, grit or anything like that to make sure they don't get impacted um, crops and helping with digesting their food that they're taking in. And if you have anything with a calcium deficiency, some uh, I've heard some people say the chicken's eggs aren't as hard or they start eating the shells or something like that. It might have a, a calcium deficiency. So it's your feed stores. They have little bags of like little rocks of calcium. I have that also that I get to them. I mix it in with their food. And that's pretty much it. I'm like, the hardest part is when they're chicks and trying to, if you don't have a coop or something already there for them, you only have a little bit of time to get all your stuff together to get them out the door and have everything set up for them. Once they're outside and you make sure nothing can get to them, hey, it's pretty simple from there. If you found this helpful, if you have any questions, I probably didn't go over every little thing, but if you have any questions, hit the comments and I'll try to answer any questions. Go ahead and hit like and subscribe and appreciate it. Two Wood Gardener, out.